Last time on Project Zomboid, we found our first base. Jeremy smashed his way through a horde of zombies and we ended up getting chased all the way back to our base. We found this garbage bag, but that wasn't enough for the horde of zombies that attacked us. It's apple seed. Wow, so I'm inside of the police station now. This is Lewis Fam. Ooh, cigarettes. Let's take that. Piece of tape. Let's take this crossword puzzle in case we get bored. And the cigarettes. Wow, so we are actually quite a distance from where the safe house is. But I may be thinking we find a temporary safe house for now somewhere near all of these community service buildings. I'm also noticing that there's two retail and commercial buildings here. So we're going to try to find a safe house along this road. So I ended up exploring the police station a little bit more just to see if I can loot anything useful. Okay, is there a zombie? Is there a zombie? Is there a zombie? Is there a zombie? Okay. Let's check these rooms. Okay, there's toilets. Ooh, lockers. Might be something inside these lockers. Oh, look at all this. Wow. This is awesome. Yeah, let's put on... Actually, yeah, let's put on this jacket for sure. Oh, wait, duffel bag. There's a duffel bag right here. Nice. Let's take the duffel bag instead. Let's equip that on our back. Nice. Not bad. I believe this is another bathroom with lockers. Yes. Yes. Oh, nightstick. Perfect. Oh, but the condition is very bad. Anyways, regardless, I'm going to grab that and take it with me. There has to be a better one, right? Ooh, aviator glasses. Let's put those on. Ooh, look at this. Is this the evidence locker? Oh, no. What is this? Sling, scope. Wow, they're all for a lot of ammo here. I'm going to take all this ammo with me. Yes, thank you. And let's take the pistol as well. So after I searched the entire police station, I decided to head out. My goal was now to find a temporary base while we look for our old base. Okay, that alerted a lot of the other zombies. Oh, no. Oh, wow. They're coming from all directions. We're going to have to fight. Okay, hit. Back off, back off, back off. Okay, okay. It's getting a little scary out here. Oh, oh, from the from behind. Oh, nice. That was close. That was sick. Okay. Nice. Wow. Insane. Absolutely insane. Classic wristwatch. I would like a digital watch if possible. Ooh, we have an M9 pistol here. We're going to take that. We're also going to take this other nightstick as well. In case the one that I have on right now breaks... We also have a bulletproof vest. I want to take that with me. I finished looting everything off of these zombies and made my way through town. Looks like we're going to have to fight our way through. They're not going to make this easy on us. But that's okay. Back off. Back off. Oh, from behind. From behind. Smash. Oh god, that zombie's crawling. We got a crawler, we got a crawler. Holy crap, this nightstick is strong. Oh, nice, digital watch, perfect. 
We got it. I made my way over to this house by the corner of the street. This house is perfect for a temporary base because it is surrounded by community buildings as well as retail buildings. Make our way into this house. Nice. Awesome. All right, we're going to use this as our temporary base for now. Let's close the curtain. Let's just drop some of these things in here. Beautiful. And we do have a can opener, which is great. Because now we can open canned items. All right, let's eat these canned beans. I do want to try to see if I can craft the spear since those are very good. Yeah, I would just need a plank and a chip stone. All right. Scrap wood. Is that something that we can use? No. No usable materials. Yeah, my carpentry is not that good. So kind of working with what we have. Oh, we have a plank now. Awesome. Zombie? Nope. No zombie in here. Oh, I hear banging. Oh, painkillers. Let's grab that. I hear banging. I might need to brace myself. It's coming from here. Okay, ready? Oh! Oh, oh wow. Skeletons? Oh my goodness, look at, there are, are these just rotten? Guitar oh, guitar case. Oh, but look. Yeah, I think these are just like rotten corpse. Wow. I'm just gonna close that door. And... Throw corpse out the window, yeah. I have a mod installed that allows me to drop corpses out of windows. That way I don't have to carry them downstairs, which is very handy, super handy. So I went ahead and started disassembling the furniture around the house. I really just want to start grabbing materials to start fortifying our bases as well as building that spear at last. Oh, I see zombies. Oh, it's a large horde. Oh, very large, very large. So one very useful tip that I learned is that you can actually run through the house, which will stop zombies from running after you, especially large hordes of zombies. I took this opportunity to head to the back of the house where I continued foraging for materials. I came across this item called Boris the Badger, but I honestly have no idea what that is. So if you guys know what it is, please let me know. Oh God, okay, yeah. Okay, there's another one approaching. Okay, there's a few more. All right, they're approaching us. Okay. Oh. Oh. Okay, we have Oh, oh, I got bit. I got bit. Oh, oh, I got bit again. Oh. Damn it. All right, scratched. We're bleeding. All right, let's just bandage ourselves. We should be fine. It's time to head back to the house since my inventory is full now. Oh, 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 snuck up on me. Oh, my God. Where are they all coming from?
Oh. 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 Oh, no. Oh, no. No. I can't believe I've done it again. I've actually done it again.